What's going on everyone? Nice to see you. Uh, welcome to another episode of Chef Lee Off Duty. Today I'm going to be making some prawn fried rice. Uh, it's a quick, simple dish, but hopefully it will go better than my previous fried rice dish, which is my uh, pork fried rice, which I will leave a link in the right side of the cards. Anyway, so we're going to get into it. It's going to be quick, going to be simple, it's going to be really nice. They're Thai spiced already. They're uh, pre-seasoned. Uh, I didn't season them, they were pre-seasoned, uh, just for a full exclosure. And I will see you in a bit, and we're going to get to it. Peace. Right, so here we, we've got some rice that were cooked yesterday. So that, got some onions, some onions from uh, a different video. My, my first video that I shot today, uh, some petit pois, three eggs, which I'm just going to beat lightly, defrosted prawns, and dark soy sauce, and light soy sauce. Also, I'm going to a bit of salt, a bit of pepper, and... sesame oil so I've got a pan on well I've got a wok on wok on body on I know that was bad so just going to lightly beat these eggs there you go Then what I'm going to do is put a little bit of salt and pepper, not too much. Because you'll get a lot of salt flavouring from the soy sauce, it's quite salty itself. Next up, where is it? My Maurice. Now I'm gonna move it over the pan. Let's hope it doesn't over overheat this time as it did in my last video. Right, so there's the pan. A uh, little bit of oil. So this is almost gonna be like an omelet. It's a non-stick pan, just going to keep it moving. these little bits right so a little bit more oil there we go <clears throat> now these are the pre-season prawns It'll take just a few minutes. And while they're cooking, I'm just going to add my onions to it. They'll only take a few minutes as well. Thank you. 
smells actually quite nice and I don't really like fish I don't eat fish so this is for my wife see now that the prawns have gone from an opaque colour to uh, a lighter colour so that's how you know when they're cooked so they've gone to a, a whitish kind of colour Right, so that's done. Right, now in goes with the peas. And then in goes my rice. <clears throat> A few splashes of dark soy. Of white, um, uh, dark. And then in goes the egg. See, a few minutes, five minutes, and that was done. I'm just going to leave that, give it a few more seconds. I might actually I might give it a little glug more of sesame oil. A little bit of pepper, no salt, and I'm just going to add a little bit of chilli because I always add chilli to my food. There you go, a few chilli flakes. And that's pretty much it, my pork fried pork, my prawn fried rice is done. Just moving, don't want to overcook the prawns too much. But that is done. Now all I need to do is just play it up. Myself a little plate just there. See how quick and simple that was. Ten minutes. Homemade prawn fried rice. Quick, simple and easy.
went down a treat. She's really enjoying it. She says it's very nice. So I don't eat prawns. I don't eat seafood. So as long as she's happy, then I'm happy. So as you saw, it was quick. It was simple. It was what, 10, 12 minutes to make it. Um, yeah, so the rice I had cooked yesterday. Uh, it's always better to, if you do fried rice to do the rice the day uh, the day before. Uh, like I said, I'll leave my link for my uh, pork fried rice video uh, up in the cards. And this one was a lot easier and I didn't have any mishaps because the last one took me three times, three attempts to make that video. So that was good. I'm glad about that. Um, I'll leave my links for all my social media on the screen so you can see that. Uh, please like, share and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Peace out, take care of yourself and I'll see you next time. Peace.